Hey everyone, welcome back to the YouTube channel. Uh, if you're watching this, thank you very much. Thank you for clicking the video. I just wanted to add a little bit of a disclaimer before this video, uh, both from me and the guy who I'm talking to side, both from our sides pretty much. Uh, we just wanted to say we don't condone the use of drugs at all. Uh, you shouldn't do drugs. And if you are struggling with any addiction or any uh, abuse of drugs, I would highly recommend that you reach out to your friend, a family, someone you trust. Uh, a member uh, that's close to you, someone that you can really, really share this with to see if they can get help. I just wanted to make that very, very clear from my side that uh, I do not condone any of this. This is purely for me to learn. I'm generally very interested in these type of things to see what people uh, people experience when they do drugs or psychedelics uh, and stuff like that. Uh, just a little disclaimer I wanted to add. I hope you enjoy uh, this short little conversation I had with one of my friends. Uh, yeah, hope you enjoy the video. Thank you. Is anybody willing for me to give them a call on Discord who's taken cocaine before <sighs> so I can ask them about it? Because like that video with about the shrooms and shit, that popped off, dude. People like that. I joined Discord. You'll talk about it? All right, dude. I'm phoning you. I'm phoning you, Chad. We're getting some convos here. Oh, yeah? Yo, what's up, homie? I'm just going to call you Kitten, okay? Oh, yeah. I mean, I'm pretty open about it to IRL as well, to be honest. Okay, cool. So... My parents know I do that shit as well. They don't really give a yeah, fuck. They, they should probably give a fuck, though, don't you think? No, but, like, as long as you do it responsibly, that's all that matters. Uh, okay, so you're one of those people. Well, okay, yeah, so, but, like I said, I only do it when I'm trolling. Okay, no, no jokes. All, all, all memes aside, legitimate. When did you take OK in the first time? First time, yo. Um, I took it 20, 2018, so it would have been... I would have been two years out of my trick, 20 years old. Okay, and did you do it because, for, like, were you at a party and your friends were like, yo, try this, or did you genuinely want to try it? I actually was out with a bunch of colleagues from a company I won't mention. Um, <laughs> but you know who I've worked for in the past, and they they had done it many times. I was fucking ignorant. And if you don't know how you do coke, you obviously just snort it up your nose generally. Uh, you can smoke it as well, etc., etc. But... You roll up like a 50 rand note or 100 rand note. Why just... not? A, okay, wait, why not a 10 rand note? Because like, if you're gonna spend 600 rand on half a gram of coke, that's decent anyway. You ain't gonna roll it with a 10 rand note. You can look like a pleb. <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty fine. I, like, I, I thought it was. I thought it was gonna be something like that. Like, why would you use a 10 rand? <laughs> it's like I just spend two grand on a gram and a half of coke and use a roll with a 10 rand note Wait, so nah. a, a gram and a half is really that's like that's like a gram and a half of cocaine is like what one line no 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 like a line typically depending on how like hectic you are is probably like i don't know 0.1 grams am i saying that right yeah like coke is very very expensive on average like you can buy like swat coke for like I don't know, like 800 bucks the G. But if you want decent Coke, you're going to be like 1200 to 1600 for a gram. Okay. And you can feel the difference. Because if it's if you're buying it for cheap, I guarantee you it's mixed with Tuck. 1000%. So, and you will notice it. So, okay, so you're, you, you're at a party, whatever the hell. And yeah, did, did someone colleagues. like pass it to you or were you like... They, yeah, they offered me, they like pulled me aside into like, I had this, it was at my old house and we had like a gym and they pulled me aside into the room and I was like, what's up? Why like, well, why are we here in private? And they're like, do you want a couple lines of Coke? I never done it. And I was like, puss safe. And I was like, fuck it. Why not? And so yeah, you roll up the notes, you just make a line, like usually with a credit card or whatever. And then you snort it up your nose. And the first time I did it, they were like, don't breathe when you do it. Because if you breathe, it just blows out everywhere. And the first time I did it, there was like four lines on a card. And I fucking accidentally blew. And it all went on the floor. You and they were post They were pain. probably so upset with you. Like, <laughs> they were so you. upset. <laughs> so but that was, uh, that was my first time. And that Coke was like decent. Like I felt it. But like it wasn't. It was okay. So but ever since. Yeah, sorry. So when you say you felt it. Can you explain the sensation? Like, the, the moment you take it in your nose, right? Like, or the moment you you take it in, how the fuck? How would you explain? It's, <laughs> it's pretty it's pretty immediate. Like, it's not like if you have, like, a weed brownie and you have to, like, wait an hour. Like, five minutes, you already know it's in your system instantly. And what, what would you say? Okay, but you're saying it's in your system. That doesn't say anything to me. What do you but feel? You, like, you can what feel you... the effects immediately. 
like almost immediately. So what would you say those effects are? Like if you had to explain it. For me, the biggest one is like, you just, for me personally, I just very, very confident. And this is like that, we, that Coke was like, eh. But when I've had proper Coke, like I can't explain it to you, but like if you like imagine your happiest moments, well, not necessarily happiest, but like your highest moment, like where you're just feeling really energized and happy. It's like that, but like on steroids. So you just and immediately feel like a boost just, of happiness. Basically. Not only that, just energy wise. So if you're drinking and doing other stuff and, you know, just the night starts slowing down a bit, have a couple lines and you're just fucking banging out again. Just feel again. Okay. So, and after you, oh, the moment you've taken it now, right? So now you're feeling confident. Did you like, did, is it true? Like I've heard that people say like everything gets colorful or you. No, it's not a, it's not a psychedelic like that. So it's, it's not. No, it's just, it just base. it's all to do with your um, neurons and your um, stimulant transmitters stimulant transmitters in your brain that's all it has to do with did you feel like everything went faster like i mean the night goes faster because you're having a fucking blast <laughs> but i don't know i wouldn't say time goes faster no okay so it's okay so would you say it's an enjoyable drug i'm okay, I mean obviously it's an enjoyable drug i'm being stupid to ask that question but i mean you'll take it again right yeah, no, for sure. Uh, it's not like a psychedelic or anything. There's no real danger unless you're buying for cheap and then mixing it with something else. So buy from someone you trust if you do like want to experiment. Okay, just just but, for clarification, I do not condone the yeah. selling or buying of drugs. Please do not do that. Um, yeah, no, like I, it's it's a thing I don't do that frequently at all. I think it's something that you should just do to do an experiment and you know, but like. The problem with that drug specifically is that it can go downhill very quickly. It said, is very, 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 very addictive. Yeah, so that's what I was going to ask you. You said it's very, very addictive. So w would you say there was a state where you might have been addicted? Or did you just no, like, did no. you just take your uh, one and you stopped yourself like the next morning? You're like, no. Yeah, no, like I've never had it more than once in a three to six month period. Okay, and do you did you get cravings like the next morning at all, or not even? Oh yeah, a little bit for sure. Oh yeah, for sure. Even that week, I'm like uh, a night out with some coke and dop and other shit would slap right now. So it's, it's just, just is it like an itch? Yeah, if you have an addictive personality, wouldn't recommend. Okay, that's just good. Okay, I'm still trying to. I still want to. I want you to like tell me, explain to me what it feels like. Like. I don't know. It's weird. You're saying that you just get confident, but like, surely there's something else confident, in your body that you feel. A lot of energy. I mean, I don't know how else to explain it. You just have like, it, it, it's not like, it's not a psychedelic. It's no, it's just, it's just with the, the neurons and the stuff you feel in your head, basically. Would you I say? I mean, there are, there are physical effects as well. Like? One for me is um, obviously like the classic, like you're, generally your nose will feel like itchy? congested almost and itchy oh, okay. yeah like it's like almost like bothering but it's not that noticeable the one for me the biggest one is your months your muscles will tense a lot so for different people it's different things but like some people like can't must stop moving their arm but not, not like in a bad manner but mm. in a good manner so That's for me like it would be like my jaws like i can't stop moving my jaws when i've had like good coke like i could just because you're just so <laughs> It's almost like ADHD in a way. You just like everything has to keep moving quickly. Okay, that's fair. Okay, I that's, I was gonna ask you now. Is it, does it feel like everything? Does it feel like you just can't sit still? Essentially, basically, yeah. Okay, but in a good way though, because you're so like happy. And when you go to bed that night, like, is that a thing? Do you go sleep, or are you like up for a day or two? Um, I mean, there's been nights where I've like done twenty four hour draws, but. If you if you stop and you wait like a few hours, you do come down. Typically, if I do do coke like on a proper night out, I'll have like a line or two, and then an hour later you'll do it again and then again and again. And that keeps you yeah. going. Yeah, hundred percent keeps you okay. going. Okay, damn, that's interesting. But so that, that, that's the that's the I don't want to say the value in it because like I don't condone it, but yeah, don't do drugs. It, it's yeah. Uh, but I think it's there's just, a lot more people that do drugs than we than we 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 expect or we think. Like you'll think yeah. like, oh, there's no way, and then you're like this person or that person. Because I'm pretty sure like some of the, I've I've 
I don't I'm not saying they do drugs, but I know people that literally just they just work all the time. And I'm there's no way you can just work for hours and hours on end and be that full of energy without without like doing something, right? I'm not saying it's necessarily cocaine, I'm just thinking like I mean there are other, other things, things that are more chilled, but I mean to say you you'll be able to tell if someone's done coke pretty easily. Is there like some? You, is the eyes a thing? Is it true that they, or is it not true? But I know that there's some drugs oh yeah, that make your they, eyes pop or something. If they, yeah, that's also one of the physical effects. If you see someone's pupils are very dilated, like very, very dilated, they have hundred percent done coke. At a jaw, if you see someone's pupils are very dilated, hundred percent done coke. But hundred okay, percent. So if so, you know, like when you drink, you get drunk, right? And you like slur your words, right? And you, um. You like slow your words, you fall around. With cocaine, does that happen at all? Or do you are you like on top of fucking shit, dude? You're like you just no, you, you actually, remember it, everything or but that's why it combos so well with alcohol and that's why people do it. It's because it almost sobers you up. You're still drunk, but like you you're so conscious. It it's I mean it's typically it's known to counteract alcohol. Okay. Damn. Well yeah. thank you for teaching me your ways. Um, once again, full disclaimer, we do not condone the use of drugs. Please don't use drugs. Um, yeah, at stay all. to the natural stuff. Yeah. If you want to feel good, maybe go, I don't know, buy yourself a chocolate bar or something and get that sweet high or something. I don't know. Um, yeah. yeah thank you for telling me your stuff. Thank you for the free oh, yeah, video. Sure. Easy claps, dude. Um, <laughs> I hope I uh, explained it. Yeah. Easy I mean, it's, it's pretty, it, it's pretty self-explanatory. I just wanted to hear like from, from someone who's actually used it. Right. Um, yeah. Because I always thought like it made you crazy and wait, I know the one, last thing I was asked, like the nosebleeds thing, is that true? Mm, I've never heard of that ever. No. Okay. No, because I mean, if you watch like a movie, you'll always see like, oh, the girl's OD'd and now her nose starting to bleed, you know, stuff like that. I mean, with coke with ODing, the only thing is you got to be careful with your blood pressure because it can make your heart pump really, really quickly. Does so, your heart rate raise? Would you say your heart rate raises? Oh yeah, for sure. Okay. Well, thank yeah. you for teaching me your ways, uh, <coughs> kitten. I appreciate it, homie. Um, no yeah. stress, dog. If I want to learn more about drugs, I'll certainly contact you because you seem to be a connoisseur. <laughs> That's a joke, by the way. He's not a druggie. Don't worry. Yeah, no. Just but, self-control. Very important. Please, guys. It's so addictive. Like, don't. Don't put he, yourself through that. What he's saying is don't do drugs. That's quite literally what he's saying. Yeah. Um, thanks, homie. I appreciate it. All right. Cheers, Talk dog. Bye-bye. Bye. Wow. The more you know.